Historically, mechanics was the first area of physics that was fleshed out by many scientists, notably Isaac Newton. Mechanics deals with forces in motion. How far things travel, how fast they're moving, how quickly they're changing speed or direction, as well as the forces that act on a particular object at a given time. So mechanics often in a first year physics course will take roughly half a year to get through. Another area of physics is vibrations and waves. Sound waves, waves traveling through springs, through ropes. Earthquakes are an example of waves. Another area of physics is optics. Optics deals with light, mirrors, color, lenses. So all of the items that you see pictured here are related to optics. Microscope, polarized sunglasses, corrective lenses. In the lower left we have a telescope, a camera. So all of those deal with the behavior of light. Electromagnetism, as you can tell by the name, is electricity and magnetism, which are very related phenomena two sides of the same coin, you might say. One topic that we don't often study in a first year high school physics course is relativity. And relativity deals with counterintuitive properties of space and time. In other words, properties of space and time that our common sense guess to be incorrect. Time slowing down, space being warped, fascinating topic, but in a first year physics course you might not touch on relativity. Another area of physics that you probably won't get in a first year high school physics course is quantum mechanics. And quantum mechanics, like relativity, deals with things that our common sense would suggest are not correct. For example, can we predict when a given radioactive nucleus will decay? And the answer is no. However, if we have a very, very large number of those nuclei, then we have an excellent idea using quantum mechanics how many of those nuclei will decay in a given time interval. Other questions or topics of quantum mechanics involve things like is an electron a particle or is it a wave or is it both? Our common sense suggests that it can't be both but it seems that the universe is put together such that electrons have particle and wave-like properties. So quantum mechanics very cutting-edge area of physics. Thermodynamics is another area of physics. Thermodynamics deals with heat work, order versus disorder. Originally thermodynamics came to the scene with steam engines back in the 19th century, but it's gone considerably beyond that now into the 21st century.